Many people who grew up on the South Shore of Massachusetts have a fond memory of digging into one of those small, thin pies. Maybe it was at Venus Cafe in Whitman. Maybe it was at Poopsies in Pembroke. The mere mention of a bar pizza on the South Shore can lead to a wild debate of where it was invented, how the crust should be prepared, and of course, who makes the best bar pizza. Here comes a pizza, see it? Dude, there's no way. It must be around the back or some shit. Right? Try, drive around. But like, I feel weird just like fucking walking in. I'm like, I feel weird about this. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. So we went up to Jay's Flying, which was a house, and I walked in, full on bar pizza place, very cool. Uh, the guy was the opposite of friendly, um, cash only. We're in the fucking middle of the country land of the South Shore, and there's not an ATM even close by. You know, I'm gonna get shit on for the fact that I didn't even bring cash, though, that's the thing. People in the comment section are gonna have all these opinions, like, hey, fucking no great cash, fucking buy pizza. That was a uh, that was an interesting experience. Uh, they don't do laced crust here, which you know I'm not I'm not, not going to be biased. You know I think laced is is good, but um, hey, what the hell? She's in my shot. We we're going to get a nice shot. That's really fucking mask. They gave they gave me a mask. It's kind of cool. It didn't come in a bag though. What's up with that, dude? What's up with like only two places having bags? You want to get me thrown out of here? Yeah. People <laughs> come in, pick up, they leave. It's a you good, know? yeah, it's cool. Right, let's keep this going. We gotta leave. We asked to leave the, the driveway. Yeah. Thank you. I didn't like the way you said that. Like, I get it. He doesn't want us posting up in front of the house doing this. We're not gonna let this affect the actual review. We're gonna pull over it pretty much right here. Rolling. All right, so we're um, maybe 0.1 miles from Jay's flying. I can pretty much see it right over there. Um, the incident with the guy, uh, I'm assuming he was the owner. Um, nothing against him, he just didn't want us tailgating in front of his house, which I get. That looks very good. That looks mm, solid. It does look good. That looks solid. All right, healthy flop. Hell yeah, bro. Mmm. This is so good. I want, I kind of want it to be bad, but this is really good pizza. Uh, yeah, this is good. Also, Pat, I think it's hilarious that the one time you called the pizza in and they got your number is the one time <laughs> some shit happens like this. Yeah. He's gonna call you back, your phone's ringing. Yeah. That guy was pissed, dude. I don't know why he got so pissed. Was I rude? No. I don't think I was rude. Like, I really don't think I was being rude. He was like, it's almost like he was ready to square up. Yeah. Don't try to suck, because he looks like one of those tough old guys. Customer service aside, this is fucking good. This is a good pie. Long story short, I go in, get the pizza, come out. We set up just like we've do, been doing in front of every place. Uh, and the guy the guy came out and, uh, you know, I mean, he, he asked us to leave. He, he didn't like the, that I worded it that way, but it, it, we were asked to leave. Right? Yeah. So we were asked to leave. So we went right down the street, right across the street pretty much. And we tried it and the pizza was great. I thought the pizza was phenomenal. The guy that came out, passionate, you know? A lot of passion. Um, and I didn't let that affect the review because it's about the pizza, not about the people. The people have a lot to do with it. Like, he was no, he was no Pat Gibbons. <laughs> um, I, 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 you're driving on the country roads and you're gonna see a little Jay's flying, like, almost like a miniature uh, lighthouse in the front yard. Like a well. Like a well. Look for the well. It's not a bar, it's a house. That's it. Like, I'm not going to be salty. I'm going to be an adult about this. Um, that's the review of Jay's flying. Look, slow motion if we can. And it, here's the Patriot. Here it comes. This, <laughs> I'm going to throw my pizza. That is not tolerated in this ballpark. We're at Linwood Cafe in um, Randolph. We're in Randolph. Fi look around. It's a five-way stop sign. Do a little 360. Five-way stop sign. Not ideal for foot traffic, but this place somehow 
became super popular, and it's one of the meccas for bar pizza. Um, get these guys in there. Here we go, here we go. Nope, yeah, cheers. No. no. It looked like he was rolling the window down. He wasn't. Um, but this is this is this is Linwood, you know? It's a nice bar. It's an honest dive bar in there, and we're gonna check out what their pizza's all about. Apparently it's really good, according to some, and according to others, it's the worst. So let's see if the haters are right or if the um, what do you call the opposite of haters? Flaunters? The lovers. The lovers. Let's see if the haters are right or if the lovers are right. Um, and that's it. Let's go. Someone should put that in a bag. The bag was started here, apparently, um, according to the guy inside. That place is really cool in there. It's classic looking. It's got the double plates. Oh, this looks... Th I got a good feeling about this. Ready? Big reveal. Okay, that looks fucking good. I gotta get a photo of this. All right, uh, and you know what? One portrait mode too. Yes, this looks so good. Previous locations during this review got stubbed because we didn't have beer with it. You gotta have beer with a bar pizza, so let's get right in here, Pat, ready? I got you. Ow, oh, that fucking hurt. hurt like a bitch. We'll, we'll edit that. Oh, he's got pizza on his face. <laughs> oh, huge. That cup right there. Huge, that's a game changing cup. You would never know. You see this cup sitting around, you're like, that thing's gross. Like this thing is like weird. This is a game changing cup and we needed that. This looks so good. I can't believe this. Laced, this looks proper. This is a good laced pizza right here. Not falling around, it's fucking tiny. It's the side of a Dorito chip pretty much. This is a great one. This is the best place we've been to so far, for sure. Pat, just eat one right now, keep it rolling. Look at that, Ooh. look at that, came right off. What do you think? Pretty good? Yeah, that's real good. It's bad. It's good, I think this This is This is very good, it's perfect. Look at the crust, really get that crust in there. Like it's a freaking circle, that's a math equation. Look at the radius of that pizza. Yeah. That is proper right there. And the beers go down smooth. It's nice, nice and shady here, nice shady trees. I heard people tailgate out here on Fridays. The lady in there was super nice. The guy was super nice. The bar was not nice at all, which makes it awesome. If it was a nice bar in there, I would have been weirded out. It's a total dive bar in there. The stools and the, uh, the uh, booths looked like they were from 1980. That place is awesome. If I lived near here, I would uh, probably become an alcoholic and fat from pizza. But it's not a bad thing, you know? I would just go in there and drink a lot and just like talk about my problems. Uh, and eat pizza every day. That real heartburn problem. Start eating Pepto-Bismol like every single day. Um, maybe get a girlfriend, maybe she cheats on me, maybe she has a drug problem, who knows? Uh, but I don't live in the area, so none of that's gonna happen, um, thankfully. But if I did live in the area, I'd at least be getting some good pizza out of the deal. Linwood fucks. Anybody who says Linwood sucks is, is just so salty and just way too prideful about their hometown. Linwood is so good. Nobody can hate on Linwood. And it's funny that I've seen so many people hate on Linwood. It's so fucking good. And we've tried so many places. This one is the best one by far. I don't have anything else to say. Slow motion if we can. And here's the Patriot. Here it comes. This, I'm going to throw my pizza. That is not tolerated in this ballpark. He has been ejected. And never again allowed to buy pizza. Ooh, oh, there it is. There it is. Someone should put that in a bag and I'll tell you take what. that away to make sure that they secure the evidence. Yeah, you know, Horatio Kane of exactly. CSI Miami will be here soon to collect the evidence.